All right, so now you're here. It's time to edit this photo. Let's do it. We're gonna do this one here in San Francisco of uh, some girl that was at the top of this viewpoint of the bridge. So I just walked up to her and asked her to take a photo, paste the portrait sauce preset on there, and uh, figure out exactly what the temperature we're gonna use is going to be just by going back and forth and figuring out which way the skin tones look the best. So we're gonna go up and down. And I feel like I found the quick, the, 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 I feel like I found the sweet spot there. Up, down, left, right, left, right, up, down. I like it to be more purpley. So I'm gonna be in this area. Okay. Yep. How are the skin tones looking if I zoom in here? All right. Okay, that looks perfect. So I'm going to export it now. And I have no idea what her name is. Oh my God. I don't know how I'm gonna find her and send her her photo, honestly. But we'll figure it out. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna say uh, San Fran. All right, let's go into Photoshop. Just finished this photo, and I made a tutorial for it, but I just, I don't know. I was not feeling the way I, I was talking in that last video. I, was, I had like, I was so slow. I was like, uh, now, now I'm kind of just, now I'm kind of more warmed up to making a video. So I feel like this video is gonna be much better. So let me go to my edits here and uh, click on that, there you go, drag it in there. Adjust the crop, drag it down to where her eyeballs are. So I feel like that's a little bit too low. So I'm gonna move up, move up to that area. So that way the line, the, this line's going through her eyes, there you go. And I'm just gonna sharpen her up a little bit. A couple clicks with the sharpen tool. That should be good. Uh-oh. It's lagging a little bit. Come on. All right. Oof. Hello, come back, come back. Oh my God, that was too much. All right, now it's way too sharp. Undo, 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 undo. All right, just, just one click was enough. All right. Jeez. One click did so much. All right, I'm gonna Put my strength down to like 29. One click. All right, maybe two clicks. Three clicks. Okay, 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 okay. Um, color layer, so we make a new layer down here. Scroll down to color. And we're going to make her teeth not blue. Not blue, we don't want it to be purple. Okay, there you go. That looks looking better already. All right, and then we're gonna take this eh, like tannish color there and paint it over the purple eyeballs. Oh, too much, too much purple eyeballs. All right, next, what are we gonna do next? Let's see, just gonna zoom out, look at the picture as a whole and figure out what I need to do next. Looks so good already. This is a really good one. Um, <laughs> hair is already the right color. I don't have to correct that. How's the dog doing? Dog looks great. Um, all right, let's just do our global dodge and burn. Not really much to I need to smooth out there. I mean, let's just run it through some frequency separation and see. It looks any better if I smooth out some stuff here. Let's just do some smoothing here. Yeah, this part's a little bit blotchy. Let's see. Mm. Yeah, that's looking smoother. Yeah, I'll keep the smooth one. All right. So now we're gonna to switch to the 
dodge and burn action. Bring back some brightness to the teeth. Because they're kind of suffering right now from the color I took away from it. It kind of lost its shine. All right. I'm going to do a exclamation point on the nose. Keep its bow. Burn the upper lip. Burn the bottom of the bottom lip. And let's see how we doing here. Getting there. All right. And she needs a highlight right here. A highlight right there. Just like that. And okay, this is way too strong of a flow. Okay, 7%. Retouching is a lot easier when you're so far away. You don't have to be that careful. All right. Underneath the chin there. Makes her head pop out. All right. I'm gonna make a nice burn for her shadow underneath her. Ooh, that makes her pop out. Ooh, I love that. That's a beautiful shadow, beautiful diffuse shadow. It was a beautiful cloudy day when we took this. I'm just gonna burn the background here, this dark area over there. Wow, and I love the purple and the red and the blue from the preset, my gosh. Looks insane. All right, so we're gonna burn it's gonna be a tough one. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, I did it on my first try. Wow. My tracing is on fleek today. Oh, I went out that time. Bam. One more time. Boom. Pretty good. Not bad. All right, that line is done. That line's done. That line's done. Or I might need to redo that one. No, that was good. All right, these ones are gonna be a bitch. Damn, there's a lot of these ones. All right, I'm gonna take a break from that and burn her pants. <laughs> burn her pants. Okay, back to the lines. And the ones up here too. How does that look? Wow, it looks so cool. So cool. All right, now I'm gonna add some glow behind her with the dodge. So wherever the glow was before, we're just gonna add it back. Not add it back, just emphasize the, the area outside of it so we have extra shadow and extra brightness, whatever you wanna call it on the outside. And then a little bit there. All right, so now we got kind of like, we got it popping out now, okay? Good stuff. The side of her neck, maybe the, the entire forehead there. Yep, I'm just gonna turn on my black and white invert. It was already there. The action already made it there. I just had to make it visible. The action is included with the tutorial on my website. If you want all the actions, they're included. Also on the bsdphoto.com website, you can buy the actions on their own separately. I haven't put the actions on their own 
onto the Portrait Sauce website yet. I will have to get around to that. But the Portrait Sauce website is brand new, developing a whole new brand over there for all the photography stuff. All right, just wanted to manually remove those dark spots. Let's see here. That's better. I'm gonna do it over here too. Awesome. Real good, real good. Should we DB the dog? DB the dog. Now that nose, that back there, the side, the head. Yeah, okay. And then just burn the front, the sides. All right, let's see how the DB dog looks. Ooh, looks very nice. That is a DB dog right there. Did I DB the side of the pants? No, I did not. All right, we're gonna add some D. <laughs> okay. Dodge the socks, perfect. Wow, what a shot. I can't believe how awesome this photo came out. All right, and we're done. We're gonna flatten that, and I'm gonna put a levels adjustment on there. Crush it down to like seven. Yeah, six, seven, yeah, six. Yeah, seven, okay. And 250. Yeah, 250 and seven, let's call it a day. We're in business. All right, sharpen and export. Whew. All set. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to tell your mom about my YouTube channel. Like this video, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.